Hey, good evening, guys. How are you doing? Good evening, teacher. All good? Good to see you. Good to see you. Good to see you, too. Good All right, guys. Okay, let's turn on those cameras and uh, let's say hi. So, what's good, guys? Janet, what's good? How was your day? Good evening. Today, mm, normal. Relax. Normal. Anything. Anything doesn't mean nothing, okay? It's either nothing or anything is not used as the nothing, okay? What do you mean with by anything? Okay, nothing. Nothing okay. special. Okay. All right, that's great. That's great. All right. So hey, is it has it rained where you're at? <laughs> No, clouds were very, very dark here, so I thought that you know it was going to rain, but but it's boring. It's not raining and it's hot. What about um, what about there, Miguel? Is it raining over there? No, it's not raining here. It's not. Oh, that's sad. All right, how's that? How's that uh, coffee, Myrna? Yes, it is with milk. All right, very good. I said, how is that coffee? Like, how is that good? Oh, yeah, uh, yeah, it's good. <laughs> all right, all right. Yeah. I, all right. How, 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 how uh, amargo. Bitter? Bitter. Or, all right, or, okay. So, or you mean, yeah, that would be bitter, okay. All right. All right, very good. Uh, what about uh, Jocelyn? How's your, how's everything, Jocelyn? How is your office? Everything good? Hi. Yeah, it was good today. Are you camera shy? <laughs> no. Do you know what camera yeah. shy means? Okay. Yeah, you're camera shy. Okay. There you go, Jocelyn. Yeah, <laughs> Juan, hello, Juan. Yeah, I can see it's very dark <laughs> there, Juan. I can I see do. your I eyes, they, they, they spell Juan Hernandez, you know. There you I go. Feel, I feel tired today. Why are you hectic. tired today? Very hectic. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Alejandro, welcome, Alejandro. How's everything? Hi, uh, everything is okay. I'm fine. Uh, right here, it is raining, but but oh, nice. Yeah, but it still feels like hot. <laughs> Where do you live in Guatemala? <laughs> no, <laughs> no, I'm from Santa Ana. <laughs> okay, same thing. Same thing. <laughs> all right, uh, all right, Irina, welcome, Irina. Alejandro Castillo, Luis, Mr. Luis Molina. Yes, How's everything, Good Luis? Good evening, teacher. Good evening, everybody. Good evening, Irina. Good evening, teacher. How's everything, Luis? Okay. Uh, hi, teacher. Hi, everybody. Um, okay. Uh, this day I work hi, on work until uh, mid midday at noon. Okay. And the off and the afternoon I stay in my house with my little boy, right? I was playing five under the rain in my house with my boy. <laughs> You're playing what? Uh, five under the rain. The rain. Five. Uh, uh, water war. Okay. Okay. Uh, you were water war, water war. Okay. Yeah, war war. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not really sure. Uh -huh. Una guerra de agua, right? Oh, okay, right. You had a, you had. Well, that's not how you say. It. I mean, uh, you were just. I mean, you just well, just call it water war. Okay. All right. Very. Oh well, that's great. So you were playing with who? My boy, my son. Your son. Oh, okay. I have my son. Yeah. That's great. That's great. Wait, your son. How old is your son? 
11. 11. Oh my god, how 11, old are you? Uh, me? Yes. A 52 year old. Oh, okay. Uh, is that is that is that your only son or you have more? No, I have more, right? Okay, but they are adults, yeah. I guess, right? Yes, yeah, I have two uh teenagers or maybe adults. Yeah. Teenagers. Teenagers. But maybe they, they are all of not uh, they are not teenager. Okay, all right. Uh -huh. I see. Uh -huh. All right. Anyways, um, well, that's nice. Okay, you're a good dad. Kalina, welcome, Kalina. How are you? Good afternoon. <laughs> all right, anyways, guys, all right, let's uh let's guys. I strongly recommend you to come on Monday because we have a very special topic, guys, on Monday, okay? Uh, which is future, future perfect. And is a lot the last class, right? Yes. Um, which is, um, so we're gonna talk about future perfect. And, and, and that's actually one topic, guys, that it's really hard to understand if, if, you, don't, if you don't have a good teacher. <laughs> All right. Future perfect is really hard to understand if you're another with me. Okay, so, so, so you know you better you better join on Monday and earlier, right? But today, I mean, we're gonna we're gonna touch touch base uh, on it. Um, I actually have I told you guys I've been telling you that we're gonna play a game. I have a very cool game today, guys. I promise you, we're gonna play today, which is practice, right? It's a game, but it's 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 you know related to practice. So we're gonna go um we're gonna go through that too today. Okay. So very good, all right? So today, guys, we will talk about predicting the future, okay? Predicting the future with Will, and we'll talk in, uh, we'll talk about future tenses in general, okay? So we're gonna go over Will, and uh, as well as um, future perfect, okay? All right, guys, so what is the objective for today? Uh, Jocelyn, would you please be so kind to help me read? Yeah. Uh... I can't. I can't watch. Yeah, yeah. You're not. Oh, I, I'm so sorry. Right. <laughs> By the end of this section, practice will be. <laughs> there you go. By the end of this section, participants will be able. <laughs> May be able to predict the future using will. Future continue, and future continues. 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 Okay, future I've in future perfect. Okay, very good, guys. So, anyways, so in English, guys, we have three future tenses. Okay, all right. The first one, guys, is actually will or going to, which is also future, guys. Okay, but we're not gonna talk about will today because um, we're not gonna use will. You know, I mean, going to for predictions. Okay, all right. So, so what's the structure? All right. What is the structure of uh, future simple? Uh, Luis, what is the structure of future simple? Uh, will or want plus base verb. All right, notice guys that when we use, I mean, will and want guys, these are, how do we call this? Okay, these are models, okay? How do we call them guys? Model. Okay, so these are models, okay, model verbs. All right, on, they modify a verb, guys, and the verb has to be in base form, okay? What form does the verb have to has to be in? I mean, what what form does the verb have to be in? Base form. Base form. All right, it has, it has to be in base form, okay? If you use will, guys, you cannot modify will, okay? Okay, yes. Will cannot be modified, guys, okay? with a verb in the future, okay? So this is not, okay, we're not gonna use future verbs here, okay? No, all right? So anyways, okay, so let's take a look at the first example, Alejandro, Alejandro Castillo, help me read. Okay, teacher, um, computers will recognize. 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 Any okay, voice, woman, you won't need a keyboard. Keyboard, repeat keyboard. keyboard. 
keyboard. Okay, so computers will recognize any voice command. You won't need a keyboard, okay? So computers will recognize any voice command. You will not, you won't need a keyboard, okay? Very good. So this, guys, is, is this, let me ask you something. Is this a reality or is this something imaginary? If I said, guys, computers will recognize any voice command, you won't need reality. a keyword. What is it, reality? Are yes. you sure? Yes. yes. Computers you will recognize your, your voice. Telephone. Okay, guys. However, I mean, computers nowadays, they don't recognize any voice commands. I mean, it's still, first of all, okay, all right. This is, guys, this, you know, these examples were created in the past, right? So, anyways, uh, for you to understand this, guys, okay, right now, you know, cell phones, computers, right, are not recognizing any voice command. I mean, they are, but I, I don't think they're perfect. But for you to understand, let's change this, okay? Let's say robots will be able to... Um, robots, robots will recognize um, people's faces in the future. Is that a reality or is that something imaginary so far? It's reality. Reality. It's reality. What are you saying it's reality, guys? Okay, let me ask you no, something. No, it's a... It's no, 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 no. Maybe in China. We Maybe in China. <laughs> Guys, focus on grammar, okay? Uh, baby, do you know Alexa? Yeah, I know Alexa. Let's talk with Alexa. Alexa, that's, play. That's, 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 that's the name of uh, my ex. So I don't like Alexa. No, oh, okay. <laughs> no, um, no I'm, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. No, I've never, I've never dated an Alexa. Um, <laughs> now they, but, they have a, 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 a male version. Alexa? Alexa. <laughs> <laughs> all right no 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 yes i i, I listen i i know about artificial intelligence okay that's how it's called however guys okay right please focus on grammar okay stop stop saying no that exists now okay we're talking about the future okay when we talk about guys in a timeline okay when and this is in grammar too right when we refer to the present the present means the truth okay we're talking about the truth okay in the past, we're talking about impossibility. What are we talking about? Impossibility. Impossibility. Okay. Impossibility. I'm like, it's kind of hard for my eyes to watch this. Impossibility. Okay. All right. And in the future, guys, we talk about possibility. Okay. Possible. Possibility. Okay. Now, guys. If I'm talking in the present, I'm talking about something real, right? Yes, because the present is the truth. If I'm talking about the past, can you change the past? Yes or no? So, for example, when I say, you know, oh, if I had, if I had bought, you know, that computer, I would have finished my homework now, right? I mean, you can't go back to the past, so you can't change the future, right? I mean, you, you can't change the past, change the past, I'm sorry, right? Now, when you talk about the future, guys, you don't know. And that's the thing. You don't know what's going to happen in the future. You can make a prediction, okay, because it is possible, okay? So possible means, okay, it might happen. It might not happen. Got it? So when I say, guys, computer will recognize any voice command, okay? Maybe, you know, this, this example was taken from a book 20 years ago, you know? 20 years ago, you know, we didn't have voice commands. To I mean, we were not so developed in uh, voice commands, you know. However, now we are, right? So when we say, guys, computers will recognize any voice command here, um, we're just predicting the future. So we don't know anything about the future. So will, guys, and this is the point, okay? Will is used, guys, for predictions too, okay? Okay? For example, what do you think, Kalina, right? What do you think El Salvador will be like in 20 years? What do you think El Salvador will be like in 20 years? Mm, I don't know. Mm, mm, 
more is no sé. I'm sorry, I don't more know. More no sé. Tell me, <laughs> you know, you know, you know. Advancing in the technology. In the um, okay, maybe, right. Uh, more, uh, more buildings, intelligent buildings. Okay, so so how will you say that? Okay, but I needed to use this future tense. Um, will be the Salvador will will be will be. Oh no, we'll have okay. A, a more intelligent buildings. Okay, very uh, good, guys. So, all right, so. Building, is, it, is, it, no, is, it, is it is it is it oh because people are not gonna get intelligent <laughs> i think that's be too ultra anyways okay right so let's see okay do we have intelligent buildings i mean we don't even have intelligent <laughs> buildings here right so also we'll have okay um smart buildings okay so you can say um you can say in the future, right, in, in 20 or in 20 years, right, in 20 years, El Salvador will have smart buildings. Now, is this true, guys? Is this for sure confirmed? Is this, there's absolutely no way that, I mean, is there, is there any, is there any way, guys, that we can confirm this 100%? Is this going to happen? Is this a reality already? Is this the truth? Yes or no? What do you think? No, right? Not reality. No, so no, guys, it's not a reality, okay? It's just a prediction, okay? Possibility. Prediction, okay? Yeah. For example, guys, let's talk about let's talk about Moises Urbina, okay? All right. So let's talk about the rain, okay? Let's talk about the weather. So I right, so so let's pretend I'm Moses Urbina, guys, and I say, all right, we will have a thunderstorm today so hey we will have a thunderstorm today is this going to happen for real guys yes or no yes yes are you sure we'll have thunderstorm today so guys if Maybe. i am with sister Vina yes. and i said all right we will have a thunderstorm today will this happen for for sure yeah. No. No, no, we don't know. No, 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 the weather. But if we say, can't be sure. We can't be sure, right? <laughs> we can't be sure it won't happen because more be, Moises more best. Uh, Moises Arvina said it, right? <laughs> no, I mean, um, it doesn't matter who said it, guys. It is a possibility, right? Right? So it might, you, you will actually might have a thunderstorm or not, okay? So it's a very strong possibility, right? That's another thing that I want you to notice, okay? Because we can use other model verbs to make predictions, right? But this is a very strong, right? A very strong possibility, okay? All right? So this is a very strong possibility, guys, right? Super, super strong possibility, okay? So, all right, so are we clear, guys? What do we usually use will for? For what do we usually use will, guys? For, for predictions. For, for predictions, okay, for predictions in the future, okay? Very good, okay, so that is, that is will. We're gonna see more about that soon, guys, okay? All right, let me get back to the presentation here. And there you go, okay, all right, very good. Now, we, then we have the future continuous, guys, okay? And then we're going to go over, you know, the structure and everything else soon, guys. So now the future continuous, guys, this is interesting because the future continuous, you know, has a couple of uses, uh, usages, okay? Um, <clears throat> let's see. Uh, Alejandro, play this, okay? Help me read the first two examples. Okay. Uh, people will be living in cities under the ocean. Okay, living in cities on the that would be so cool, man. You know, yeah. All right. <clears throat> All right, that's that's okay, that's great. Okay, now second example, uh Miguel. Okay, robots will be performing most factory jobs. All right, robots will be performing most most factory jobs. Okay. Now this is funny, guys, because if you know if this 
if this example was created like 20 years ago, it, this became a reality, right? Computers will recognize any voice command. Now, today, you know, it is a reality. If this example was created like 20 years ago, guys, this is this became a reality. Now, all right, now these 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 two examples right here, guys, they haven't become any re any reality, right? So what happens here? Okay, so why when I what, what happens when I say people will be living under the ocean, robots will be performing most factory jobs. What what are the uh, two things that we have in common here, guys, in both sentences? <laughs> what can you yeah. notice we have in common? Uh, will be. Will be, very good, okay? Will be, will be, okay? So will plus the verb be, guys, okay? So you have to use them, guys, okay? You have to, okay? This is not, this is not optional, guys. You have to use will be, all right? He will be, Cheyenne will be, Dua Lipa will be, I will be, okay? Very good. After that, guys, you have to use, and you have to, you have to use a verb in ing, okay? You have to use a gerund, okay? You have to use what, guys? You have to use a verb in ing form, all right? Yes. Probably. Okay. All right, very good, guys, very good. So anyways, um, now, if I say, guys, people will be living under cities, in cities under the ocean, okay? Now, is this something that it's gonna happen for real? Yes or no? <clears throat> yes okay for me. all right very good okay all right so okay so it's also used for predictions right so what is the difference between computers can i say people will live in cities under the ocean yes it's correct all right yeah which is correct right very good right um so but there is a difference okay we're going to talk about that too okay now, future perfect, guys. Uh, when we talk about future perfect, that's that's a, a very, 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 very different thing. Okay. Now, I, I I'm not sure if you could see that completely through there, but let me share it again. Okay. So, anyways, um, so here, guys. Okay. So when I when I'm talking about future perfect, I will talk about an action that at some point in the future will be over. And you have to use will have those past participles. <laughs> All right. We're going to see that, okay? We're going to see that. And we're going to go over the structure on that on Monday, guys, okay? This one is the most, this, this, this dance right here, guys, is crazy. Uh, I love it. Um, you will use, you will learn how to use it, you know, automatically but um but right now guys okay i mean you have to learn it pretty well right but today guys okay we're going to talk about these two um so let's let's go with uh future i'm sorry not let's go with future continues okay all right so guys when i say okay so in these examples guys when i'm talking about computers will recognize right computers will recognize any voice command you won't need a keyboard okay this is actually guys this is like you're saying something will happen and you're like 90% sure, okay? So there is 90% 90% possibility of that happening, okay? All right. When you say we'll be living, guys, okay, that's just a prediction, and that's that's less of a prediction, okay? So with future continuous, guys, all right, this describes okay, both are used for prediction, but this future continuous, guys, it describes a what? Ongoing action. All right, it describes an ongoing action, something that is happening continuously, okay? All right. Um, Janet, okay, and what about future perfect? What does future perfect describe? Describe something that will be completed by a specific time. A specific, repeat, a specific. specific. Very good, a specific. A specific. Time. specific. A specific time. There you go. You did as and then specific. A specific. Okay. A specific time. Very good. Okay. Good job, guys. All right. Notice, guys, that future perfect needs a date or time of completion. Okay. But we're going to see that. We're going to see more about that. Okay. All right. So let's talk about will, guys. Okay. Who would like to help me read? I can help you. Go ahead, Luis. Thank you. Okay, uh, the future with with will. There are 
two basic future tense used to describe things that happen in the future. Uh, beside these two, there are some other future tense which can be started on the advanced future, future tense page. The first uh, future tense is the future with will. Use the future with will uh, to talk about an event in the future that you have just decided to do uh, for prediction and for promise. Promises, okay, repeat promise. decided to do, the repeat decided to do. Decided to do. Okay, predictions or promises? Prediction and for promise. Predictions. Predictions. And for promises, okay? For predictions and, and for, for promises. promises. Prom very good, okay? All right, very good, guys. Thank you, thank you, Luis. You're amazing. Thank you. All right, so examples, guys. I think I'll go to the party next week, okay? All right, so again, guys, this is, um, again, either a, a prediction or it's a promise, right? What is it? What, what is it more likely to be, guys? A prediction or a promise? I, I think I'll go to the party next week. Uh, prediction. All right, prediction. Very good. What about the economy will get better soon? What is that? A prediction or a, or a promise? A promise. No, the economy will get better soon. Do you really know if it, that, that's going to get better? Oh, well, yes. It's a soon. prediction. It's a prediction, right? Now, yes, I will marry you. What is that? Prediction. All right. That is a, it's a promise. That is a mistake. mistake. Okay. <laughs> 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 that's, that's good. Oh my God. Why are you saying that's true for poor wives? <laughs> your wives, I'm going to tell your wife, I'm going to tell your wives to, to watch this class, right? So, so whoever said, oh, that's true. Okay. Right. You're going to be in trouble. <laughs> All right, no, guys. Okay, so yeah, it is. It is a promise, right? Yes, I will marry you, right? I mean, who's gonna say yes? I will marry you. Just joking. Hey, do you want to marry me? Yes. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding, right? Who's gonna say that? No. I right? so if we say something like that, it's just, you know, uh, it's it's a it's it's um it's a promise, right? I mean, I will marry you. Okay. Got it. She will marry you. He will marry you. Okay. Hi, right, guys. So um so these are you know the three examples that we have, right? Now, notice, guys, the only thing that you have to notice here, aside from using, you know, the, the, uh, um, the model verb will, you have to use the verb in what form? Base form. In base form, guys, okay? All right. Any questions so far, guys? No questions so far? Very good. Okay, that that is simple enough, guys. By the way, guys, I'm gonna. Th this is just you know. This is I'm gonna teach you some. Some. Um, well, I'm gonna teach you a phrase, guys, which is very commonly used. I use it a lot. Um, and this is actually, guys. I'll ask you this, okay? If I say, let's say that you know, my car won't work. Am I talking in the in the future here, guys? Remember, what won't, guys, is like saying will not, right? will not it's a contracted form or will not so when i say guys my car won't work am i talking in the present in the future in the past what am i when what times am i talking about here in the future negative and i'm talking in the future negative okay all right so um, let me rephrase Is the that. present mm, who said it? who said it's that in the, in the past wow 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 okay right all yours is okay right that's all right <laughs> All right, so, okay, all right, hold on. So who said in the past? Oh, that was you, Marina? Yeah. <laughs> mm, okay, all right. Negative. All right, people from Santana, okay. Why, why, Marina? Okay. <laughs> all right, well, why, all right, that's, that's good. I mean, every, okay, right, let's analyze this, okay? Why, why would it be in the past? My car, my car won't work. What do you think? What do you think, Mirna? Why? Why is it in the past? Because it's a prediction, right? I don't know. Like, if my car don't uh, doesn't doesn't start, no, it, yeah, I don't know how how to say about like that. Yeah, but I I I I'm gonna say uh, 
my car won't car won't work. <laughs> I don't know. In the past, so okay, all right, all right, all right. Oh yeah, it's oh. in the present. Oh, it's in the present. You said in the I past. Don't know, teacher, I don't know. You said in the past, okay, right? What do you think, guys? In the future or in the past or in the present? Yeah. No, it's the thank future. Thank you, Marina. Thank you. You think it's in the future, okay? So, Marina, at the end of the day, Marina, is it in the past or in the present? I didn't understand. Uh, I think or, that it's the past. You, you still think it's the past. Okay, very good. All right, so who's, who said that it's the present, guys? I think it's present. All right, Kalina, why do you think it's present? Because because the car won't work right now. So my car won't work right now. I mean, but, but that literally means, you know, my car will not work. So I'm, I'm using will. If will is used, for the, if it's used for the future, why does it mean the present? All right, so guys, this is an expression, guys, okay? This actually is will not, right? So it is, it seems like, we're talking about the future, okay? But no, guys, this is an expression commonly used to talk to refer to the present, okay? So this is an exception, guys, okay? I'm talking about the present here. Oh, my car won't work. So it means my car doesn't work, okay? Instead of saying my car doesn't work, you say my car, my car won't work, okay? All right? Very good, guys. So that's just an exception, okay? Very good, guys. All right? So now this is the structure, guys, of the future with will, okay? So when we have a positive sentence, what is the structure when we have a positive sentence? Um, uh, Laura, hello, Laura. Laura, how are you? Good to see you. Hello, teacher. All right, Laura, all right, could you please help us read the structure of positive, negatives, and questions? Uh, positive subject plus will plus verb. Okay, all right, so this is the structure for a positive sentence. Very good. What is the structure for a negative sentence? A negative subject plus will plus not a want plus verb. Okay, very good. And what is the structure for a question? Questions, word plus will plus subject plus verb. Okay, thank you very much. Following this structure, Paco, give me an example of a positive sentence. Everybody do my favor, send me in the chat, guys, a positive, a negative, and a question, okay? <clears throat> Paco, let's go. Okay. Uh, get up 2 a.m. tomorrow. Oh, what? I will. Get up uh -huh. at 2 a.m. at 2 a.m. tomorrow. At 2 a.m. tomorrow. Okay, very good. Okay, really, really good job. Thank you. Thank you, Paco. Okay, so that sounds like a promise, Thank right? You. I'm gonna call you at 2 a.m. and see if you're, uh, you know, see if you're awake. Okay. If not, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get you extra homework. Okay. <laughs> All right, very good. Thank I, you. I need an alarm. Please help me. <laughs> All right, Rafael, okay. Negative form, okay? All right, give me a sentence with a negative. I mean, give me, give me negative sentence in, in, in the future. I... I will not go to work tomorrow. Okay, I will not go to work tomorrow. Okay. Tomorrow. All right, I will not work. go to work tomorrow. Okay, that's good. Okay, good job, all right? He's a liar. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> He's a liar. Okay, Jocelyn, give me a question, Jocelyn. Um, what will uh, he eat tomorrow? What will he eat tomorrow? Now, let me ask you something, guys. Why am I not changing? All right, so why am I not changing the verb eat? Thank you, Jocelyn. That was great. Why am I not changing the verb eat, guys, here if it is in third person? It's it with S. Because we no. have... 
Because there you go, Mirna. Applause for Mirna. Good job. Okay, right. Thank you. Because we have a model okay. verb, guys. Okay, right. Okay, auxiliary. Right. Auxiliary. Yes, the auxiliary guys already uh, modifies this. Okay, these guys okay. remember yeah, has eating. to be in base form. Okay, what will he eat tomorrow? So if we want to modify it, it has to be in base form. All right. Very good. So let's take a look at your examples, guys. Um, Miguel says, I will work tomorrow. Janet, I will wear my new blouse on Monday. Mar Miguel, I will not visit Mexico next month. My cat will eat tuna tomorrow. All right. Why wouldn't he eat tuna today, Jocelyn? Uh, give him. Give him what he wants, okay? <laughs> my mom will cook dinner. <clears throat> I mean, chin chin I was going to say chinner. Chicken, okay? On... on on weekend, on the weekend, okay, very good. Uh, Paco Raban says, I will, I won't have classes on tomorrow. I won't have classes tomorrow, not on tomorrow, okay. Janet, you won't talk in the class. Myrna, my dog won't want, to, won't want to play with me. Of course, your dog doesn't want to play with you. <laughs> I'm kidding. All right, uh, Alejandro, she will not be my girlfriend. Wow, okay, all right. Because you have a wife, right? <laughs> All right, uh, Janet, when will you have your new car? Whenever you buy it for me, Janet, thank you very much. I won't have classes tomorrow. No, you won't have any class tomorrow. All right. Good job, guys. Okay, right. You got it, guys. I think you're, you're good with this topic. You could be teaching this topic now, okay? All right, now, um, now future, future continues, guys. Okay, the future continues. We use it to talk about an ongoing action, right? A future continuous tense sometimes also referred as the future progressive. It's a verb tense that indicates that something will occur in the future and will continue for an unexpected length of time in the future, okay? So we don't know when, when that's gonna stop, got it? All right, so that's good, guys, okay? So it's, a, it's an action in the future. We don't know when that's gonna stop and it is, it is continuous, okay? All right, the structure, guys, the structure that we have for that the root verb, so the base form of the verb plus ing, right? So for example, guys, all right, okay. Um, there is something that you know that you must know before we we get uh, we get to talk more about future continuous. Okay, guys, the future continuous, right? Or any continuous form, but 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 you know um, any continuous form, guys, needs action verbs only. What kind of verbs, guys? New action. <clears throat> verb. Okay, right. Action verb. All right, let's see, all right? So let's talk about love, okay? All right. Tell me, okay? So, so um, let's say, let's see, all right? Can, can I say this, guys? <clears throat> can I say, I will be loving Dua Lipa <laughs> Dua. tomorrow. Can I say that? Is this correct, guys? I will be loving Dua Lipa tomorrow? Oh, maybe. No. Why not? Oh, because love is not an action verb. Because I love her today, okay? Not tomorrow. No, that's, <laughs> it's because, guys, right? It's because, all right? It's because it is, guys. An action, it is not an action verb, okay? Love is not something, it's not an action. How can you represent love, guys? All right? So if I say, guys, I will be loving Dua Lipa tomorrow is incorrect because the action of loving, guys, I know that McDonald's says I'm loving it, right? But I'm loving it, guys, it's just, you know, it's a, it, it is a grammatically incorrect expression, but, but it's, you know, it's just, Colloquial, okay. So this right here, guys, we cannot use it, okay, because this doesn't represent action, okay. That's an emotion, and an emotion that is not, all right, that that is shouldn't be used in any continuous form. So the right form would be what, guys? What should I say here instead? Love them. Not. I will be. I will. I will be working. I will love you. Oh, love. Oh. I will love you, okay, all my life, okay, right? This is a right expression. I will love you all my life, okay? 
All right, can I say I will love to a lipa tomorrow? Can I say this? But now here's, it. yeah, go ahead. This is this is technically correct, guys. I mean, the, the grammar expression is correct. Grammati it's, it is grammatically correct, correct, guys, okay? However, all right, the idea, all right, the idea itself doesn't, all right, doesn't make sense, guys. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, I hope that you can understand <laughs> that. <laughs> Trust me. This is Trust me, I'm a doctor, okay? <laughs> all right so okay so anyways right all right so all right so i know guys that you know how to how to create uh tenses in in the future right but yes guys you cannot use um stative verbs okay so no stative verbs with continuous tenses unless they're taken as nouns okay but that's a different topic okay so no stative verbs guys so what about what about have guys? Can I say I will be having a child tomorrow? Can I say this? I will be having a child tomorrow. No. No. All right. People would say like this, but it is grammatically incorrect. So the right way, guys, is I will have a child tomorrow, right? Yes. Miguel, will you have a child tomorrow? No. <laughs> Will you, uh, Paco, will you create a child tomorrow? <laughs> Possibly. <laughs> also, in my hand. Yeah. Oh, my God. All right. All right. Very good, guys. Very, very good. Okay. So let's continue. Okay. All right. how, how do you say chinear? Oh, okay. That's what you meant. Okay. Oh, my God. All right. So. I will have. Tito, come on. All right, so anyways, your anyways. Mind, okay. detail, your mind, your mind. You with your mind. So anyways, guys, okay. That, what, what do you mean my mind? I didn't say that. Okay, very good. <clears throat> anyways, all right. So now, guys, <clears throat> I said that we were going to play a game, okay? So I lied to you. <laughs> I made a promise, right, because I said, well, no, we're going to play a game, guys. I'm kidding, all right? Um, it's called Jeopardy. Uh, Jeopardy, guys. So basically, all right, um, I need you guys to, what you see there, 100, 200, 500, blah, blah, right? It is money, okay? Do you like money? Of course, right? No money, no honey, right? Yes. All right, very good. So, all right, so look at Jocelyn. It's the first time that I see her all interested in the, interested in the class now. She's like... <laughs> she's like correcting her posture and everything all right so anyways guys so i need how many are we we are how many are we guys we're we are 13 right 13 we can make two we can make four teams four teams of three right two four teams of three and i mean four i mean three teams blah, 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 three teams of three and one of four right <laughs> why are you why are you laughing huh? I mean, <laughs> all right, very good. So, yes. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, I told you guys, that's why I don't teach math, right? <laughs> that's why I teach English, okay? Um, very good. So, Kalina can teach math, right? <laughs> she was correcting me yesterday. All right, anyways. So, all right, so I need four teams, right? I need you guys to write down the name for of your... Um, of your um oh my god i need you to write down the name of whoever is going to be with you okay so i'm going to mention the names and you just writing them in your novel because i'm going to mention the name of the team and you know who i'm talking about okay so mirna jocelyn alejandra i mean alejandro and alejandro play this oh i think we're gonna have two alejandros never mind case so mirna jocelyn alejandro alejandro both Alejandros, you guys are going to be team number one, right? All right, Miguel, Kalina, Luis. Wait, 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 I said three, right? Well, you got, okay, so it's four, right? And then three here, Miguel, Kalina, and Luis, okay? You're team number two. 
All right, team number three. Team number three, okay. Uh, Miguel, right. Paco, Janet, and Juan, you're, you guys, you know what? No, no. Paco, Rafael, and Irina, okay? You guys are team number three and team number four, Laura, Juan, and Janet, okay? Write it down in the notebook, okay? Because I need you to know your teams, okay? All right, very good, guys, okay? So this is what you're going to do, okay? I'm going to say category and 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 the first we're gonna go in order of, of teams okay so team number one is gonna choose the category first then you guys whoever says you know me team team one right that's gonna be the person who can answer the question and get 500 points 300 points whatever amount of points you bet okay um if you answer incorrectly you're gonna lose those points okay you're gonna i'm gonna subtract those those points okay all right so Team number one, name for your team, real quick, guys, because we only have like about 10 minutes. So, team number one, what name do you want for your team? Quickly, quickly, off. If not, I'm gonna choose it for you. Five, four, three, two, one. Too slow, guys. Okay, think about your name, guys. Maluma, right? You're gonna be Maluma. Maluma, <laughs> baby, right? All right. This is hey, your name for your team, right? All right, team you number go. team number two. What team do you want? What what name do you want? Team number hey, two. Luis, you what do you want? Okay. E. Goals. Okay, very good. Eagles. Okay, very good. All right. Team number three. What what name do you want? Tigers. Okay. Ty. Tigers. Okay. Tigers. Okay. Very good. All right. Very good. Okay. <laughs> I know. All right. Team number four. What name do you want? Team number four. Next is number four. No, no Goose. team number four? Uh, no. Yeah, but I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I don't know, okay? I don't, I don't know. know. <laughs> Thank you, okay? All right, very good. So I don't know, team, I don't know. Thank you, okay? All right, guys, so we got the four teams already, okay? So team, team Maluma Baby, all right? Maluma Baby, choose a category. Categories are, are up at the top, guys. True or false, complete, right or wrong, uh, right or or wrong and correct riddles or talk for 50 seconds. Which one do you want? Actually, this talk for 50 seconds is gonna be talk for 15 seconds without mistakes, okay? 15, because, because we don't have time, right? So, all right, so quickly, all right, Team Aluma. All right, what do we want? Yeah, true or false. For how much? True or false. I for how, how much money do you wanna bet? How much? 100, 200, 300? 400. 400. Um, Remember, okay? Now, guys, everybody can 500. participate now, okay? 500, okay? 500, okay? So, guys, after I click on 500, everybody, you need to say, me, Maluma Baby, me, Eagles, me, Tigers, me, I don't know, okay? Got it? <laughs> got it, got it, got it? Okay, very good. Okay. So, three, two, one. Be ready, guys, okay? Be ready to say, me, 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 right? So it says, what's the difference between future simple and future continuous for five hundred dollars? Me. Me who? Me who? You have to say the name of your team. Tigers. 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 Okay, me tigers. There you go, tigers. Let's go. What is the right answer here? Okay, different is future simple. Use the base verb, and the future continuous use the ing. Uh, Jerome. Good job. Those were Tigers, guys. Good job, Tigers. Okay, good job. You got $500. All right. Okay, all right. Eagles, what category do you choose, Eagles? Quickly, Eagles. If not, I'm going to give you the chance to somebody else. Let's go. It's complete. Complete for how much? For $500. Uh, it's okay. 400 Okay, very good. Three, two, one. Go. Promise me, blah, blah, blah. Not called before 10. I hate being walking up early. Eagles. Me. Me, Eagles. Tigers. I heard, I heard Eagles first. <laughs> Eagles. Okay, Eagles. Let's go. Eagles. For my, Let's go. For my, me, you. Promise uh, me. Wrong for now. Okay. If you pronounce her incorrectly, guys, I'm going to subtract points, and I'm not going to give you the points. You're going to lose the points, okay? Luis, be careful. <laughs> so, so let's go, Eagles. From, okay, thank you. Uh, promise Promise me you you won't call before 10. I hate being walking up early. 
earlier. Okay, very good. Okay, you, good job. All right, very good. You okay. Call. All right, Eagles, you get 400 <laughs> points. Thank you very much. Promise. 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 I'm going to forgive him, okay, because all right, he's early, but the pronunciation is early, okay? Very good. All right, Tigers, okay, what category do you choose, Tigers? Okay, right. Mirna, let's, let's, come on, right? I was waiting for you, like, ah, right, me, Maluma baby, okay? <laughs> all right, so, so, all right, so, uh, Tigers. Correct. Correct or incorrect, okay? For how much? How much money do you have? <laughs> 300. What? 300? <clears throat> okay. Yes. All right, so, you guys will be, have a great time in the Bahamas. Me, Maluma. Me tigers. <laughs> Eagle. Okay, all right, one more time, okay? Three, two, one. Eagle, Eagle baby. I heard, I heard, I heard, okay, Maluma, baby. Let's go, Maluma, baby. How much? Uh, oh, well, uh, what is it right? Is this right or wrong? And why? Uh, I, I think it's wrong because the verb B, you will have, you guys will have a great time in the Bahamas. Maybe? Beautiful. That, that's the right answer. Good job. Plus, really, Andrew, guys. Good job, my little baby. You got 300 points. All right. Great. Thank you. All right. I don't know. By right, what category do you want? I don't know. For the 50 second. The what? Tell for 50 second. 50, not 60. 50. All right. 50. 50. All right for how much money? Two thousand. All right, two thousand. Two thousand. There is no two thousand here. <laughs> two hundred. All right, two hundred. Okay, very good. All right, so you're gonna talk for ten seconds, guys. Okay, so okay. let's go. So, uh, what will the president of Colombia be doing at this time tomorrow? Me, uh, me, tigers. Yeah. All right, tigers. Let's go, tigers. Wow. You have to say the name of your team, guys. Tigers. Let's go. Three. Two, one, too slow. Another team, guys, another team. Another team, guys. Me. Uh, Who's Maluma, me? Baby. Maluma, let's go, Maluma. Uh, the, president, the president of Colombia will be doing... Um, this time. Uh, for... <laughs> uh, 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 you have me, to see. Me, tigers. Me, tigers. Tigers again, tigers again. <laughs> Three, two, one. Come on, guys. All right, another, another, another Pre one. President of Colombia will be having breakfast tomorrow at 7 a.m. Pronunciation uh, having. Uh, incorrect, okay? I'm so sorry. Uh, what, 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 what team is your team, Paco? Tigers, Tigers. right? Tigers. So you lose 200 points. You're back at 300 now, okay? <laughs> dan, dan, dan. I'm sorry, right? So... All right, so Maluma Baby, what category do you want? Quickly, Maluma. I don't know. Uh, I'm not uh, I Alejandro. <laughs> true or false? Uh, true or false, okay. Uh, Jocelyn says true or false. How much money do you have, uh, okay. Jocelyn? <laughs> How much money do you want to bet? 3000 Three thousand. Three hundred. That's that's the money you have, right? How much do you want? Okay, so she has three thousand dollars. Okay, all right. We are so, rich. Yeah, you, sure. you guys are rich, right? So three three hundred. Okay, so okay, it says we will use future simple will base form when we make a decision at the time of speaking. Yes, true or false? Me, me Maluma, Maluma baby. Maluma, Maluma baby. Maluma false. Baby. Me, I think no. False. You, all right. So Maluma baby says false. Okay, the answer is. Right, yeah. so oh. you lose 300 <laughs> points, you're back at zero. <laughs> All right, it's too funny, guys, for me at least. All right, very good. Um, all right, let's see. So, Eagles, okay, let's go, Eagles. Real, false, also true, false, true, true or false for, for how much? 400. 400 and not 100. All right, very good. Okay, so with your bad work, with your bad work, you will work, you will work in for this company anymore next year. That is correct. It's Eagle. Me, Tiger, is for Tiger. 
All right, Tiger, is it, is it right or wrong? Tiger. Uh, it's wrong, sorry. It's wrong. wrong, okay, yes, mm -hmm. it is wrong. With your bad word, you won't be working, okay? Good job. Tiger, 700 points. Good job, Tigers. All right, well, Tigers, choose the category, Tigers. Let's go. Riddles. What? Or Migos. Riddles. Oh, Riddles. Riddles. Okay. I don't think Riddles. All right, let's not choose Riddles, guys, because Riddles is, is very complicated, okay? All right, nobody knows Riddles in English. So, <laughs> wow. all right, so uh, choose any other of the other categories. I mean, any other category <laughs> from here. True or, or false. false. True, or, true or false. Okay, true or false. True okay, very good. False. All right, so let's go with true or false. How much money do you want to bet here? 400. 400. Okay, very good. We will, we usually uh, use while to describe progressive situation. Eagle. Eagles. 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 Okay, Eagles, it is, is correct. correct. You said that is correct. Okay, then 100 right. points for Eagles. Thank you very much, Eagles. All right, good job. All right, next one, uh, we have the, 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 the Tigers. I think it's your turn. I'm not sure. Tigers, choose the category. Oh, 300. What? 300. Ah, oh, I'm three, sorry. Three. Is correct. Correct or incorrect? Yes. We don't have 300 here. I'm sorry. 200 then, teacher. 200. Okay, very good. So it says, when she arrives at the school tomorrow, Michael will teach the B2 class. Right or wrong? Hey, Maluma, no. I, I heard Maluma. Maluma, what is it? It's wrong. It's wrong, okay. Why? Why is it wrong? Because uh, we have to add, uh, she will arrive. Okay, okay. It is wrong because he will be teaching, right? All right, all right, 200 points for Maluma. Good job, Maluma, all right? Very good, okay? <laughs> all right, guys, so one more, guys, one more, okay? So I don't know which category. True I don't know false. which category. Complete. True or false, for how much? 100. How much? Very good, okay? So one. we will use will plus infinity to talk about predictions with evidence in the future. True or false? Maluma Eagle. baby. Maluma false. baby, let's go. I'm yeah. gonna give I'm gonna give the points. Okay, so if you say it's false, I'm gonna give the points to Maluma, Tigers, and Eagles. Okay, because you guys answered. Next is infinity. So it is false, guys. So everyone gets yes. two hundred. Okay, I'm gonna give one. I mean, one hundred to everybody. Okay, so the winners, guys. Okay, Eagles with nine hundred points. A plus for Eagles, guys. Woo, Eagles. All right. Then we have Tigers with eight hundred points. Good job, Tigers. Okay. Then we have Maluma Baby. Okay which is um, 300 points, okay, in third place. And then we have, I don't know, with 100 points in fourth place, okay? <laughs> Good job, all right? I'm sorry, Maluma baby, but same as in music, you know? You, I'm kidding, all right? <laughs> You're not first place. Uh, anyways, guys, so I hope you like the game. So, guys, did you like the game? Yes. Yes. All right. I liked it more than you probably because it was, yeah. you guys are funny. All right, so we'll have, guys, We'll have a fun activity, guys, on Monday as well. Um, please come early, guys. It is our last day together, guys, so let's just have fun. We're going to go over the platform, too, and we'll talk about Future Perfect, which is a really nice topic, okay? okay. Please be early because Future Perfect, guys, it's – I will dedicate the full 30 minutes uh, – 45 minutes, guys, I'm sorry, to explain Future Perfect, okay? All right, so – I needed okay. to be early, right? Thank you, guys. You guys are awesome, all right? Hope you like the class today, and I'll see you on Monday. Thank you, guys. Okay. See you on Monday. Good night. Bye. 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 Bye.